So how easy is it to spoof an email? Well, I'm gonna show you, but please don't try this at home or on your neighbor that you really like. All you really need is access to any SMTP server. This could be your own server or even some online services that don't properly verify sender identity. Then use a simple script, maybe 10 lines of code to send an email with a forged from field. No need to put a hoodie on and channel your inner Mr. Robot. No password cracking, no sophisticated hacking tools. That's it. Just exploiting the fundamental trust model that email was built on 45 years ago. The reason this particular scam is so effective is psychological. When you get a threatening email from your own address, your first thought isn't, this must be fake. It's, oh no, I've been hacked. The forged sender creates panic that bypasses your normal skepticism. But here's a simple test. Check your sent folder. If the email isn't there, your account is almost certainly safe. It's just spoofing. Now, this might seem like just one email scam, but the implications are massive. Email spoofing enables business email compromise, where criminals impersonate executives to authorize fraudulent wire transfers. The FBI estimates that these so-called whaling attacks cost organizations a staggering amount every year, over $2 billion. Email spoofing enables phishing campaigns that steal millions of passwords by impersonating trusted brands. It spreads disinformation by creating fake emails from news organizations or the government agencies. But the deeper problem is trust. Email is the backbone of digital communication, handling everything from personal messages to critical business transactions. 